night sky Our love secret line Like leaves we soar so high Beneath the moonlight Self-touch your hand in mine Gets me every time Hi and welcome So today I'm talking uh, I'm I'm telling you about uh, a magical little drink uh, that you can get from nature during the springtime and I'm talking about maple water and in a later month or like later weeks birch water we have a tradition uh, of collecting both maple and birch water when I was a little girl, we always did it during the springtime. It was the highlight of the spring when you can finally get the little magic drink from the tree. Maple starts running usually um, like end of February or beginning of March, depending on the weather. Uh, best weather for maple trees to run is when it's still cold during the nighttime and already warm during. Um, the daylight or like the daytime and for the birch trees they usually start uh, in March in the second half of March or uh, in April a few days ago I went up my little pathway and drilled a hole to the trunk of a maple tree and been collecting some maple water uh, for the past two days now the, the amounts have been small right now because uh, it starts running better when it's sunny outside that's what I'm waiting on because past like many days we have had like fog and cloudy and everything like that Last, yesterday it was so thick fog you couldn't even see in front of yourself which was um, not so spring like usually this thing happens during the fall or like autumn but I don't wanna talk too much so let's go and see what is going on with the maple trees and when we come back we'll talk more about uh, all the benefits of uh, the maple water so yeah let's go
now I um, pulled out uh, like pulled up a little bit of information about the maple water so the maple water contains 2% of sugars and the other 98% uh, is actually just water so it's basically like a sugary water but really low on sugar and very low on calories um, it's basically the blood uh, like lifeblood or of a tree so if you think like that I'm being a vampire to a tree so <laughs> Because it's carrying the same, like the way it's carrying the nutrients and everything that the tree needs to grow and to be alive. And the same thing goes with our blood. And as blood donoring and everything, you can't take too much. The same is with the tree. So I'm trying to not take too much because I have quite a young tree that I'm getting the water from. Uh, it is over 20 centimeters in um, that diameter because you can't take from smaller one it will try the tree out um, but I I've been trying to take very little each spring and I actually have another three uh, another maple tree next to it uh, like a few meters away so I'm thinking that maybe next year I'm gonna take some from that one and leave this one to rest for a year at least so as it turns out the maple water is basically like a sports drink uh, most of all the benefit is that it's replacing the lost uh, electrolytes but it can also reduce muscle inflammation uh, because of the antioxidants hello my cat came here okay he's been a little velcro recently so that's why He's here. He wants to uh, cuddle me all the time and sit on my lap wherever I go. So, hi baby, how are you doing? How are you doing? Now better when you're in my lap, right? <laughs> Burring already, so you can sit here. <clears throat> let's, uh, let's continue uh, with our research into the maple water basically so it stabilizes blood sugar levels um, because of a plant hormone in the fluid oh and I didn't know it's supposed to be cancer fighting have like cancer fighting pro uh, properties through micronutrients called polyphenols they do say it's actually good for your gut health it, it's good it replaces um, electrolytes it helps with uh, muscle recovery and everything like that but it isn't like a miracle cure in any way uh, but I like to think of it like a little miracle like a little uh, magical potion or like a magical drink you can get from the trees from the woods which is like really very cute idea of giving some power for the nature again like or like some power coming from the nature into us the same thing they use in Canada for maple syrup actually uh, but they just boil the water out so they when they are making uh, maple syrup they have to boil it down from um, like 40 gallons of maple sap to make one gallon of syrup so you have to get rid of the water uh, from the sap I hope you enjoyed this video and you found something uh, interesting from it, uh, some new knowledge just for entertainment and I really urge you if you have uh, the possibility go try maple water or birch water. If you have like maple tree in your garden or in your friend's garden or something or birch tree or if some uh, local stores sell it uh, check it out because it's really worth trying worth trying so I hope you like this video if you did please consider liking it it helps a lot and I appreciate it a lot so and leave a comment below if you have tried it if you would like to try or you'd rather sit th this one out so I don't know I think I'll 
cheer you with my maple water and I will see you next week. Bye!